hello guys welcome back so we had an issue uh, in the previous one it was showing blank so what was happening is if we if I'm creating something what happens is we check the DB it is sending the object so what we have to do is instead of doing this we either we need to use the spread operator or we have to send this object as it is because we are sending an object so we don't have to uh, again put it inside an object here so that was uh, my mistake so let me just send it now and check I'll just delete the entry here okay. and let me just make another entry so Raj As you can see, you can, uh, this has been entered here. So if I click here, okay, I'll just delete this. Looks like it was not deleted. So let me remove the console logs wherever it is not here. Yeah, we can make this here. And we also don't need this here. Okay. So now we are good. So we'll create one more user. We'll create uh, uh, Jesse City New York. Okay. okay. So I Jesse. I'm from New York and I'm a hacker. So now our application is ready. So this is how Redux works. Basically, it is just a uh, like a library which we are using to manage the state. This is our local state and this is the uh, where it is in app.js this is the global state that we are using so we are actually pushing the state uh, the uh, local state into the store and then we are passing it uh, to the provided and through the provider it is going down to all the components and from there we are dispatching actions and that will again be pushed to the state uh, to the store through the reducer so this is the uh, basic uh, cycle that I would say that uh, how Redux works. So that's all for this uh, series, and I'll be adding the code for this uh, this video series in GitHub, and I'll add the link in the description below so that you can download the code and check it. So that's all for this, and yeah, keep watching. Thank you.